What is going on guys? Today we are going to be doing some wood carving with a Dremel. This is my um, Dremel I got. I think it's just, um, I got this from Harbor Freight, believe it or not. I believe it was like $20. And then I ordered some Dremel heads off of Amazon. Some nice, some nice, um, a lot of bits. I haven't used most of them yet because I haven't found a point yet, but... I got a lot of stuff. I got some um, whittling tools. And then I also have a wood burner that I just picked up. Um, I um, haven't been able to do a lot with it, but we're not doing anything extraordinary today. We're just going to practice on this little bit of 2 by 4 That's normally what I practice on. And, um, I haven't decided what we're going to do yet, so we'll check back in and... Uh, we're gonna get something so done. I'm not a class A wood carver, but I have done a few things and um I'll throw some pictures right here into this and Um this is the bit I've decided to use and I don't know if you can see that really. Yeah, there we go. And I might switch it out. I'll um throw up if I switch out anything. I think what I'm gonna wanna do I'm just going to stick to a nice little nature scene and I somewhere around here I have my nature that I've done before and that's like the one I'm proud of the most so I'm definitely going to throw a picture of that in and um let's just get started see what happens so, so far what I have done is I kind of have like the shape of the mountain a one mountain done and I'm going to go through with this with this bit and I'm kind of going to like shade it and fill it in and um I think I'm going to do that for one or two more mounds, depending on how much I can fit in. And yeah. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna break out this thinner this thinner bit I have and I'm gonna try and put a better tip on the mountain right here because right now it's kind of bland I'm just see if I can't fix that up a little bit Alright, so since I was holding that sideways, I kind of got too fat of a side, like right here. So I'm gonna try and um, I'm gonna try and save it at all at all things necessary. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna come down this side and try and make it a uh, triangle again. Let's see.
So I think this is going to be the best save that we can do for this mountain, but I'll touch it up. I'll make it look pretty. So what I just did is you can kind of see some burns on it is I kind of just held a lighter to it and try and tried to take off all the really loose ends that was in on it and it kind of worked. I got some burn marks but I'll be able to touch that up and get rid of it. So what I've done here is I went ahead and I made another mountain. Another mountain and I put a little hole for a sun up here. And I'm gonna I'm gonna like make this texture look better but I'm also I want it to look like texturized because I'm gonna paint over top of this here and I'm gonna put like a little stream coming through here and then um, I'll finish this up. I'll show you guys, and then I'll break out the paint and show you what's next. But there, there's the view right now. This guy looks like a weird smiley face right now. But I have the sun up here. I have two mountains. Then I'm gonna use this little um, indent I made as like a stream. And I'm gonna go get some paint, and I'm gonna paint over this. And and um, I'll show you guys what colors I'm choosing to use and then I'll kind of put in like a time lapse of me painting it. So this is the situation I got going on. I got some of these colors and then I have paint brushes and I have a little pumpkin filled with water to rinse my brushes off in. And um, I'm just going to paint this. I think you can imagine what, where the colors are going but I'll put a little montage starting now and of me painting. 